Clothes for Kids is a little microfinance project in Kathmandu. Its mission is to provide jobs for women and to take begging kids off the street and put them in school. I worked as an investment broker. I started on Wall Street in New York City and I worked for 23 years and decided to retire early and come to Asia to study uh, Buddhism. Six years ago I had what I call my Mahayana crisis, which is all these Buddhists talking about benefiting other people, but I didn't really see much of it happening. I asked one Lama, Chikanima Rinpoche, and he said, look, all I'm talking about is go outside, whoever appears in front of you, you help them with whatever skills you have. That's all I'm talking about. So I ended up uh, here in this camp and looked around and said, okay, this, this, is, this is where it happens. And noticed women making these amazingly beautiful blankets. And I thought, oh, that could possibly be a product. That could be something that they could work on and could be sold and they could earn income. And the idea behind Quilts for Kids Nepal is pretty simple. The women in this begging village make quilts and uh, I pay them about $40 a quilt. That money comes from my own pocket or from sponsors who just make donations. The quilts are all sold for $140 each. Every penny of it goes to put one kid in school for a year. It pays the enrollment cost for the kid, it buys them shoes, uniforms, books, and a new backpack, and they go to school for a year. If you look out in the field here, they've been, they've been working here in the sun where it's a little bit warmer. This, one, this woman's name is Arti, Arti Devi, and she comes from Bihar State also. Her husband died suddenly oh, wow. three, three months ago. And when that happens in India, it's, it's over. There's no way to support your family. So now she's got a job and a way to support her kids. She has one child. I came down here thinking that I was going to uh, change all of them and in the end, of course, I was the one that ended up getting changed. It's rare that people actually have an opportunity to help. Uh, in the West, we're quite, uh, we're quite well off and we don't need that much help. Here, there's a huge opportunity. Everywhere you turn every day, there's a way that you can help in the world. So, uh, to finally find out that helping feels good, helping makes me happy, was uh, one of the great uh, little miracles that happened down here every day. Namaste! Namaste! Namaste. Namaste. Can! I said